Hello everyone, welcome to RPA Stuff. In today's video, we are going to learn how to execute a Python script using Automation Anywhere 360. We will see how to execute functions with input and output parameters, and how to pass multiple parameters. Please note that Python should be installed on your runner device. If you are unable to run the script even after installing Python, it may be due to the environment variables on your system. Refer to the YouTube video mentioned in the description to resolve this issue. Let's go to Automation Anywhere and search for the Python script package. Drag and drop the open script action. Here, you have the option to import a Python file or provide the script directly. I will use the manual script option for this demo. I have a Python script that shows a hello world message in a pop-up window. This script imports the tkinter library which is a standard Python interface to the TKGUI toolkit. It allows you to create graphical user interfaces. Since it is a good practice to close all open sessions, our execute actions will be between these two actions. Now, take the execute script action. Mention the session name, and you can assign a variable to get the output of the script. This option does not store the value of any return value from the script but the execution status of that script. It can be either true or false. Now let us add message box to see sample string value and run the bot. The script is executed, and the pop-up message is displayed behind our window. Let's bring it up! The sample string value is true since the execution was successful. Now, let us learn how to execute a Python function with input and output parameters. I will take a separate open action and disable the previous one. Here I am providing simple Python code in which the function my underscore function takes an input x and returns the result of 5 times x. Now let us add an execute function action. Here we have to first provide the function name, which in my case is my underscore function. Now, since our input parameter is a number, we have to create a number type variable. I am naming it input parameter and I am specifying a default value of 3. I am assigning the output of the script to a string variable named python function output. Let's have a message box to display the same. If you think this video is informative, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. As you can see, we have our script output 15. If you've noticed, we currently have the option to pass only a single input parameter. But what about multiple parameters? The solution is to pass a single string variable with comma separated values, which we will split in our script. This function takes an input string with two comma separated values, converts them to floats, and returns their product. For example, if the input string is 3 comma 2, the result would be 6.0. Now let's create the string variable to pass values. I am providing default values as 8 comma 9.
Let's save and run the bot. Our bot ran successfully and our script output is correct. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more such content.